The Red Lake Skate Park has been exposed to a lot of spray paint vandalism over the years. Last week, the Red Lake Boys and Girls Club, along with some students from the Red Lake Middle School and graffiti artist Ezra Wilson, decided to cover up the negative spray paint with graffiti art. Ten vandalized spots at the park were covered with art that represents Ojibwe culture. Some of that art can be found at the skate park, including the Medicine Wheel and the Seven Teachings of Ojibwe Culture. The project took two days to complete. The executive director of the Boys and Girls Club says the new graffiti art that covers up the vandalism brings a new vibe and flavor to the skate park. You have the skate park, represents the skateboard culture. You have graffiti art, representing graffiti culture. And then we applied the Ojibwe culture, the seven teachings, and we used graffiti art to express that. So it's a clash of cultures, so it's relatable for the kids, and it also teaches them some Ojibwe culture. The graffiti artist was in Red Lake for a week-long residency with the Boys and Girls Club. He taught them the history of graffiti and how to make different graffiti fonts pop. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.